Can you give us a bit more information about the integration of Atkins? Well, it's going really well. I, I mean, we laid out the plan right at the beginning, which was a 100-day uh, integration program. I mean, that essentially the vast majority of that was complete uh, in the third quarter. So we've gone through, we've identified the cost energy uh, process, which was the, the first piece. And then we moved on to revenue synergies, which was really all about how do we create one in one uh, to equal more than two. Uh, so it's all about revenues, business development, uh, working with clients. So we've had our 10 main workshops plus uh, a couple of other additional ones. They're, they're all complete. We've got the recommendations now. Uh, and we started uh, to announce and implement uh, the, the changes there. And that will go on for another four weeks or so, but we will be complete, certainly by the end of the year. Uh, so everybody will be really clear about where we go from uh, the 1st of January. Very good. So where do you see the combined entities after those change? Where do you see the company going? Well, I think the, uh, the thing that we identified and, and the thing that was really appealing for us around the skills and capabilities of Atkins, you know, apart from, you know, 18,000 really talented people, was that they operated uh, across our sectors, uh, in the main within infrastructure, uh, rail and transit, uh, and also in energy with, with nuclear in the main, but very much at the front end uh, of uh, the work that we do. So you're meeting a lot of clients every day mm. all around the world. So what's the point of view of the clients of that acquisition? It's, it's about making sure that when you put two component parts together, whether it's individuals or parts of the organization, that we're delivering more than what uh, these individual component parts or the individuals would uh, you know, deliver to clients on their own. Uh, normally in these processes you are looking at um, how do you put together the, uh, the combined entities, how do you put together the materials to explain the capabilities to clients. We've had clients actually pulling us in before we've even completed that exercise. Uh, especially in nuclear, in rail and transit, uh, but also in some of the uh, the technology aspects uh, around digital engineering, technology, security and the likes.